In this class, we'll learn how to detail the skateboard assembly in SOLIDWORKS 2010. Let's begin the class opening a detailing sheet. We'll use the render layout. Open the skateboard assembly. and insert three views as shown here. Now there are three views of the skateboard. Let's create a projected view. Click Insert and Drawing View and then project it. Select the front view as a reference and drag the mouse diagonally to create an isometric view. Change the display style to shade it with edges in the property manager to view the material. Define the placement by clicking the mouse for the new view. Great, we have created a projected view. Now we'll import the exploded assembly file to the design view. Let's right-click the mouse on the isometric view. Select Properties. Activate the Show and Exploded State box and Confirm. See the parts have exploded as shown in the assembly file. Now let's add number balloons to the parts. Click Insert and Annotations and then Auto Balloons. Select the view where you wish to add balloons. Click the exploded view. See the preview. Change the balloon layout type to Top and Confirm. Conclude and see how the balloons move as a group. Group the movement. Select all the balloons and right click any place in the graphic area. Select Group. See how now all the balloons move as a group. Disable the group option and manually adjust the crossed balloons like this. Great, we have inserted the part numbering. Now let's insert the dimensions. Activate the Smart Dimension command. Insert the dimensions as shown.
So now let's create a bill of materials. Click Insert and Tables and then Bill of Materials. Select the exploded view, for example, so that SolidWorks can generate a table based on this view. Select the Parts Only option in the Property Manager so that the parts will be listed in the table without any connection to assemblies. Confirm the operation. See, the table is displayed. Define the table location by clicking the mouse. Click the arrow next to the table. See how the part features are shown. and then roll the mouse over them in order to view the part. This is another new feature in SolidWorks 2010. Congratulations, the skateboard is defined in SolidWorks. In this class, we have learned how to detail an assembly and create a bill of materials easily and practically.